Hi, um, I'm putting this video out because this might, I might be getting arrested soon for, um, some BS racial vilification, just for being nice enough to offer to teach a guy how to be more Australian, um, because I, I got caught short at the petrol pump and had to leave my iPhone 7S and I even made a good faith payment just only a day ago, like Thursday, I made the good good faith payment payment of ten dollars, and all I did was the guy started just because I wasn't able to come up with the cash by t today, by Friday, um, he had the nerve to send me the message that he's going to go to the police. <laughs> when it's like, hello, dude, it's not necessary. I I make him I I I, I do freelance work. <laughs> I, I can't believe this guy. I my word is bond throughout Sydney. Like, what the hell is wrong with people these days? All I did was offer to teach him how to be Australian, to be asked him to be chilled out and relaxed about it, like not stressing me out more with the threat of police, and he, he he's mis mistakenly. Uh, you know, interpreted that as somehow being ra as being a racial thing. It's got, oh my God, I just can't believe how messed up this world is now. I can't even offer to be nice and teach somebody how to be Australian without that being misconstrued as being racist. What the freaking hell is wrong with this? You know, I'm sorry, but if somebody's being nice and offering you to teach teach you how to be more more Australian, you know, or whatever, like, if you, that's not racist, that's just being nice, like, what is, what is this world coming to when an offer of help, an offer of, you know, is, is, mis, is misconstrued as being racist, uh, Aussies are laid back and chilled, we're not, we don't stress people out like that. I've got enough crap going on in my life without the threat of police right now. I mean, it's just becoming beyond a joke. Just because I'm perceived as white, even though I'm part ab Aboriginal, <laughs> I have to put up with this racist BS, you know, <sighs> because he doesn't understand what I, what I was saying, you know. It's just so typical so typical the world we live in today that if i try to offer to be nice and offer to teach somebody how to be australian that's somehow seen as racist i mean what the freaking hell if he hadn't have threatened me with police i wouldn't oh my god i just can't believe this it was just so unnecessary for, threaten, for him to threaten me with police <sighs> I mean, this is this is the world we live in today, where if you if you're perceived as white, if you say anything that upsets somebody of a different ethnicity, you that they can go and accuse you of being racist when you're not being racist. I mean, it's just become beyond a joke, an absolute beyond a joke. Uh, this is racist, that's racist, everything's racist. I'm sorry I'm not the most politically correct person, but that doesn't give anybody the right to accuse me of being racist when I'm not. I mean, I have, oh my God, I just can't believe this. Uh, it's just so beyond ridiculous. I the re, I, I will say, it, and I know it's, every, you know, people don't get it. Yes, I've had friends, lovers, what not of every ethnicity and religion there is. I'll say it again. And the only reason why people like me say that is because if I was actually racist, hello, I, I would only have white friends, you know? Duh, you know? I don't, I'd only have white Christian men if I was actually racist, you know? That's, that's what gets me. And that's why people like me straight up because it's like I have had friends of I've got friends and lovers I've had I've got friends and of eth different ethnicities and religions I've got I've had lovers of different ethnicities and religions so to call me racist is just a 
ridiculous because it's like if I was actually racist I wouldn't have those I you know I support the local um I support I I you know I support the local um uh you know immigrant community by uh, eating their restaurants and things like that and everything uh, it's just ridiculous to you know I, that I still have to that I have to put up with this nonsense constantly just because uh, this is the world we live in today where everybody misconstrues anything somebody like me says and uh, I'm just uh, I'm just so fed up with it it's just so beyond a joke can't say anything nice can't offer to be helpful and teach somebody how to be Australian without being misconstrued as racist somehow